that's the easy way to drive T post. Point where I can. Do I have a good woman or what? She took over for me. This monotonous task. If anybody has a faster way of doing this, let me know. Since everything has to be on the ground around here. chickens did to the, the bale of straw I bought. They got up in here and trashed it. Can you tell what we're getting ready to do? More fencing. almost got hit by that. Anything you want to tell everybody? It ain't cheap being a farmer. <laughs> okay, we are moving T-posts with more fencing. We got fencing on the back. And we got more fencing here. Cattle panels. I'm going to show people what the ingenious deal your dad built for stretching fence. Okay. I did this. This was my add-on. <laughs> He's saying this was his add-on. Is that called a U-bolt? Shackle. Shackle. I needed a bigger one. But that one works. He said he needed a bigger one, but that one works. lovely part of a TYM tractor. We've got rear mounted controls. Rear mounted controls in case you couldn't hear him. to get the flail mower. <laughs> now I'm in control. Can you hear that? Now he's in control. <laughs> Great, he didn't scroll up there. He's in control, remember? Hang on. I was going to show you that Katie did. It's still hanging on for dear life up there. But I had to hang on. <laughs> 
here. I think they've been sleeping back here quite a bit. So while he is cooking up the flail mower, look what our steers have done to our fencing. Our new good fencing back here. Probably should have known better. There's a double fence. And then there's the good sheep and goat fence that they have just laid over. And that's a big ravine back here. This is a, a pretty deep part of it. So, so much uh, vines and growth. It's really hard to see back up and through down in there. Let's see what he's he's doing. me to back it up. Is that what you want me to do? Back it up a little? Okay, let's see if we can do this, guys. You're going to have to tell me when. Was that all right? You will? as my rear view mirror because I can't see. I can't see him.
This was the other deal I was going to show you on, I don't know if these are on a lot of tractors or if it's just a TYM deal, but when you're hooking these track, these implements up, you can, uh, you do this and it'll allow you to slide out, I think it's two inches. So when you're close, but not close enough, you can slide this out. You got a little bit of play room in and out. And then, uh, like I said, we've got the sticking my finger in front of the lens we've got the back control so I don't have to walk around and do everything from up there I can make it go up and down from back here but uh, yeah this flail mower is uh, it's a beast and I'm so glad we have it though yeah it'll it'll eat the stuff up so uh, and it's actually got the the hydraulic piston that drives it uh, side to side. So if you're like mowing a, a roadside or bar ditch or something or right along a pond dam or something like that, you can extend it out. It doesn't go real far out, but it'll it'll kick it over there some so you, you're not, uh, it's hanging out farther than your tractor tires are. So that's good. It's got, uh, steers uh like the back end of it oh my. <laughs> but uh all these these pins right here you can adjust these all the way up where they go down farther and the explanation i got on that was if you want to keep the stuff that you're uh chewing up if you want to keep it in there longer that'll that'll help keep stuff in there longer and then it's got the the roller back here that flattens everything out so so far it's a it's a good one I know there's some uh, differing opin opinions on uh, Titan implements I guess there was some problems at one point but so far this one is uh, it's worked flawlessly for us so yeah I bought the tractor and and the uh, the flail mower I bought these from uh, 57 equipment over in Chandler uh, so far I uh, don't have any complaints from them we got all the power attachments on it yeah Woo. oh come on breeze yep I need to build a guard to cover this right here cause this bottom one right here for whatever reason when you uh, are in brush and stuff like that it can reach up and release that one it won't pop out it'll just release it and then you lose your your uh, hydraulics uh, I think it was it wouldn't go I don't remember if it was up or down it would only go one way and uh, hauled it up to Chandler and while I was inside they were checking the tractor in to keep it and take a look at it and by the time I got back outside he was like fixed it <laughs> He, he found it and he fixed it so I guess that's something they see fairly often but anyway so far loving the tractor it's doing a good job but the, okay, the third function the yeah the third function hook up right there that's to run the run the claws on this this thing has been a lifesaver so you probably if you've watched any of our other videos whenever we're doing firewood and stuff I just pick logs up with this and then stick them out the side and use that to hold it while I chainsaw them up into the rounds that we need for our wood stove. So, yeah, there's Miss <laughs> Lovely. She's enjoying the she's enjoying the <laughs> enjoying the seat and the cool breeze that's blowing it's a by cool here. Breeze. Yeah, because it's ninety ninety two. Ninety two. Yeah, it feels like 100 or 101. It feels good here in the shade. Yeah. Yeah, this is just a little bit of red dirt randomness that we will bring you guys. 
just things that we're out here doing spontaneously and we have fence fencing projects that are underway and in the waiting and so we had to unload some um, more materials that we had to go get so he made me unload them he made me get on here and have a refresher course um, and that's probably good I unloaded it I just had you drive the tractor that's true <laughs> yeah I, I, I've been on think, it for 30 minutes. I didn't remember what all I had done. Yeah, don't make people think I'm out making you get out here and do yeah. No, you will Hard labor. I do hard labor. I do a lot labor. of hard labor. <laughs> labor. <laughs> labor. <laughs> okay. Okay, so now we just got to go pick up our mess. And he's going to put this thing up. And get, and get in the pool and cool off. Yeah. Get wash, the buggy. The, wash the sweat off of me. Okay, so don't forget like and subscribe and ring the bell and all them <laughs> all them little icons down there. Do all that stuff. It helps us out. Appreciate it. <laughs> Sorry about the wind, guys. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>